Uh, welcome to Citizens Forum. This show is being filmed on January the 19th, 2016. The new year. It started off in many, many ways as crazy as, as the year before. I don't know how many of more of these kinds of years we can go through, so we've got to make some major changes. Uh, first part of uh, Citizens Forum is always the Walter and Jack show, so, so I'll start off. Uh, I'd like to apologize to both of our viewers, or all of our viewers, about the fact that last week's show wasn't on. And I'd just like to explain why. There was a disagreement between us and Shaw about some comments that were made. And, and that's fine. So we've kind of worked it out. And and we are definitely going to continue to do the best job we can of, of giving people information that isn't available in a lot of other places and really nowhere on television. Except, of course, on a few uh, community television programs, which are so important in our country. Community television, when I read the rules, I just thought, wow, our parliament did this. The rules are wonderful. And they allow us to come on, uh, on TV and, uh, and, and be a counterforce in a very, very, very small way to this massive monolithic corporate-owned media that, you know, 24-7, it's, it's given it to us. So um, we had this disagreement, and, you know, I think we've sort of worked it out. Uh, it was a pleasure, as always, to deal with the various people at Shaw that we were dealing with. And, um, and we'll go on from there. Um, well, I, I, I'll just comment a little bit. I mean, I, I, it, you know, we have expressed our opinions quite freely over the years here on this show. And I've, I've most, a lot of times I get comments from people saying, I wonder how long this truthiness is going to go on. And I said, it should it should go on all the time. That you know, what we are seeking is are the facts and the truth of the case. Sometimes, like Mark Twain said, you know, if you uh, report on things that really up some people, really upset some people, uh, uh, then you you are a journalist. And if you're not upsetting some people, then you are just a public relations person. So uh, you know, I think. We're dealing with a lot of controversial topics on, our, on this show, and uh, we often uh, take positions that you don't hear in the mainstream, but we believe are true, and uh, I think we're always pushing the envelope. And the other thing is, of course, like Post Media today, you just uh, talk about amalgamating a bunch of newspapers in Canada and, and getting rid of a whole bunch more journalists all the way across the country, and of course, everybody's been bemoaning the reduction in, in, in uh, the points of view that are being expressed as each journalist's job is lost. Uh, you and I may say, you know, you have a thousand people spreading a bunch of BS, so that if you have 500, it doesn't really matter. But there is a case that here where we are seeing concentrated control of information. And all it tells me is programs like this just become more and more important because uh, these, these points of view are being eliminated just simply by uh, concentration of uh, newspapers. So um, before Walter starts talking about Shawnigan Lake, just, just to let people know that I think, I'm not exactly sure what the letter says, but I think I'm being sued um, by the lawyers for the company that, uh, well, South Island Resource Management Limited. So, and, and I've heard that, uh, just from a friend, I don't know if this is fact, but I've heard that quite a few other people are being sued too. So, that's happening, and, uh, and just, just to let people know. Mm -hmm.